is working okay see now you can see the omega t opened now first i have to go to tools align files no project tm nothing doing i have opened omega t i am directly going to align files no project nothing tools directly align files click the word it will ask what is the source language and what is the target okay now i am adding a french file as a source okay sample 1.fr and a english uh, you have to set the language if it is wrong you have to set the language correctly and then you have to browse and set the source file and then browse and set the target file see sample 1.fr is the source in this case and sample 1.docx in the english file is the target okay so i have set next just i am going to give okay so it has come maximize it you can see that one source one target one source one target okay so th uh, this is actually a simple file you can see here just before the word manoj and all there are tags okay so there is uh, no tag in the source so what i am doing is i am i am going to select remove tags so that those tags are not there now you can see tags are not there if i uncheck that those tags are there it may be due to formatting like uh, bold or something uh, that is why it is uh, i didn't add any tag in the word file but somehow some formatting has come unnecessarily see here uh, there is a tag t0 something like that anyway now that is i didn't uh, add any tag so just i am going to click remove tag so that nothing is there and if you want to ignore any segment i don't want to add this pair okay i can uncheck that next stage maybe okay see don't uh, do any other setting this is the source file content this is the target file content they have appeared here in bilingual okay now what i have to do is i have to click continue okay once i click continue see i can disable some segments and all because these are all repetition if we feel that uh, this particular line is not uh, related to this particular line then maybe you can remove that i am a project manager so this is not okay uh, see let us check one by one this is a tradus text okay next this is a memo queue sample word fast my name is govind rajan jampel govind rajan uh, manoj choudhury malik choudhury jampel kavita ilsapel uh, rajan i am a french translator okay so here this is actually wrong so what i have to do is i have to uh, actually these three are not required i am just uh, clicking see i am selecting three cells and give merge so all the three becomes one then again i am merging this way to delete this is not required this is extra see i am a french translator from it is in uh, so oh, actually all this thing i live in india i'm going to give you edit actually it is wrong uh, alignment it is tedious task only be it trados or any cat tool it is going to be very tedious only sentence by sentence only you have to do even omega d is better in alignment 
now if i merge all these thing it will become merged okay this line and this line now again i'm going to merge this line and this line then i'm selecting this and clicking up arrow actually it is a little misalignment that's why it is coming like that so you i know it is hectic but uh, there is uh, no other option that you have to do manually so this file the uh, in source side there are one or two sentences missing and in target side there are uh, two sentences extra so that is why this misalignment anyway if you are going to work in a big file like 5000 word 10000 word you have to check one by one only see even if you buy sdl trados there also it is going to be one by one segment only but you have two methods in sdl trados uh, but anyway you have to check every sentence by sentence segment by segment only okay there is no other option whenever you want to create a tm from separate source file and target file the process is called alignment now left side french file and right side english file I am I am just uh, aligning the file name and then uh, making it uh, correspond to one to one one on one I have to check so this is a small you want to create a TM from separate source file and target file the process is called alignment now left side French file and right side English file I, I am I am just uh, aligning the file name and then uh, making it uh, correspond to one to one one on one I have to check so this is a small file so you could easily do the checking but if it is a big file you have to do very carefully it will be a troublesome task only no doubt So just you have to select uh. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah Ah, then you have to create separate file only see I will show you the source and target file now okay let me show you in the word You should create a separate uh, source and target only. Now let me open the target file. Actually it was done from English to French. Okay, this is a Trado sample. My name is Govind Rajan. Uh, I am adding uh, this line should not be there. okay see this is the english file with every english and this is the separate french file okay some parts are not translated that's why it is like this okay so if you have separate source and target file with the equal content uh, see this is french file this is english file okay like that you have to do if you have a bilingual file you have to create separate source and target file suppose you got a bilingual word file you create a separate word file with only source then create another file with only target then create it you got a bilingual excel file with the first column in english and second column in tamil or second column in hindi you create one source excel file with having only english content and you create target file with only Hindi content or Tamil content or whatever okay then you have to align Excel is better for alignment okay now if something is wrong see this is both here also English here also English so I won't select the checkbox I will leave that okay the thing is I will take up and I won't add this I am a French translator from Chennai this is both are in English 
okay no need to add i will add from first segment to this segment then i will ignore this segment this segment also i will ignore then i will add uh, this segment again these are all repetition so i am not adding so i have done the alignment what i will do i will click save tmx so it will ask sample 1 hyphen fr en i am giving some name dot tmx save so that is saved okay anyway omega t doesn't allow you to open and see the tm file uh, okay see this is the file